princesas, hola princesas y muñecas. Bienvenidas a mi canal. Welcome to my channel, Millennial Susie Homemaker. Today I'm going to be sharing with you ladies a pink vanity tour. Woohoo, long awaited. Starting off, I got this uh, vanity light set, which I have to replace the batteries on from Rainbow. The vanity is from Amazon for a very cute princess like makeup vanity and if you are like me um five five around 150 to 140 uh pounds then to fit comfortably in this vanity it's pretty wide so you have enough leg space these um knobs didn't come with it i got a little bit of makeup on it don't mind that <laughs> Um, but yeah, these pink crystals do not come with it. I purchased it separately and installed it myself. It's really proud of my handiwork. On the top shelf here, I have my everyday um, makeup bag, which I will create a separate video for. This is my Mariah Carey perfume i do have many inspired and celebrity designer dupes but mariah carey has always been one of my favorite singers so i wanted to get the authentic version and then here i have my lip glosses and lipsticks from milani and these are um the nyx butter glosses Too Faced, and one that i got at rue 21 this is from City Trends, Melon and Pop and Makeup Bag. Here I have my little doll, a mirror that also has like a zoom version, my makeup brushes, and then on top is where I keep like my um, little hair accessories. And like, on this side are easy access things that I need like my um, powder, my sharpener, little loose pigments, glitter pigments, lip balm. This is a brush that I love to use to comb my hair with. I got it at Claire's and I added this little pom-pom to it. The bristles are very strong and I love the bedazzled on them. This is a makeup well, like a vanity mirror I got from the Dollar Tree. Ultra Cinderella vibes. <laughs> and now to move forward to my favorite part of the vanity, my eyeshadow palettes. Ta-da! As you can tell, I have a lot. <laughs> and these, I got them from um, Marshalls. Uh, many of them were all under 10 US dollars. Uh, like these from BH Cosmetics was $6.99. That's part of the sugar cone, the cotton candy, and the pistachio eyeshadow palette. Let's start. That's, they're very pigmented. I always get so many compliments. So if when going in between colors, I like to use this to um scrub off the powder the previous color that i was using and then transition to the new one so this is really helpful for that and then the next one i got here is a another my eyeshadow palette it's a movie theater theme and this one is a coffee latte theme the coffee latte eyeshadow palette looks like see I love the lavender colors the sparkly very pretty and then this one is the movie theater popcorn theme super cute and then here I have three of my favorite palettes from makeup revolution these two uh, actually, this one I got for $3 on clearance in new condition. Uh, and these two were $6.99 each at Marshall's. 
This is surprisingly very pigmented, neutral palette. I really love it for every day. It's the Salted Caramel. The next one is the Turkish Delight eyeshadow palette. And I use this a lot. <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, I'm hitting pan. And the final palette in my Pink Vanity Tour is my favorite for my Melanin Pop and Divas, specifically for the bronzer. Okay. So on camera, it's showing pretty light, but this is like a very dark chocolate um, bronzer. It's matte. As you can see, my skin color, it looks similar, but it's literally like about two to three shades darker. And I really like it. It's soft and these are just beautiful, very pigmented colors. I'll go ahead and swatch it on my hand so you'll be able to see what these highlighters look like. Here's also what they look like swatched on my fingertips. <laughs> That's the rose color. This is the lavender, the gold, and the um, pearlescent color. I only do that because I'm the only one using this eyeshadow palette, but I always use my brushes instead of my fingers. So there it is. It is from Makeup Revolution.